I recently filmed a video with a bunch of some of my favourite YouTube creators. But they had no idea there was a huge plot twist coming. This is Liam Bedford's Lockdown FaceTime with See, for the last few weeks, one of the things that's been getting me through lockdown is this bloody song. The winds blew up her bird up and it's been literally everywhere. And this song gave me an idea. What if I borrowed a certain video idea and made YouTubers sing this song without having any clue they were singing this song? But I couldn't just ask them to read it out for me. That would be way too obvious. So I needed a decoy. This is Liam Bedford's Lockdown FaceTime Quiz. And here is your host, Liam Bedford. Bedford, Bedford, Bedford. And welcome. I, I'm not saying this, but I've genuinely all my life I've been completely shit at quizzes. No. <laughs> <laughs> I feel tense, to be honest. I'm not really too sure what to expect. You know, I've been trying to revise over the last 24 hours, but it's tough, you know. Stuff. Oh my god, what will you think of that? I know. All the best ideas on this channel. How are you feeling? Are you feeling confident about this? How's your general knowledge? Yeah, it's pretty trapped, but I'm feeling confident nonetheless. They're really easy questions, okay? So you don't need to stress okay. out. Good, because right? I'm brain dead. <laughs> I mean, I hope I don't embarrass myself and not know a really obvious one, but I think. I think overall I should be ready yet. Yeah. And it's all about how quick you can get your questions and who's going to be doing best right, in the quiz. Important. Well, and then I basically asked a load of bullshit and easy questions and hoped no one caught on. Three, two, one. At the start of a fairy tale, what is said? What's my time? The letter that comes after N in the alphabet. M. M and oh, fuck. Say it again, sorry. Oh. What's the last shot played in golf? Hot. A little boy destined for the stage with his dance moves but needs the approval of his family first. Ting Tings were famous for a song explaining that they were not called Stacy. No, so, so what's the name of the song? No, I don't they know. Call they call me her. They call me Stacy. They call me her. Uh, no, that's not my name. That's not my name. That's not my name. Correct. What's another word for male ejaculation? Uh, jeez. It, it's not the answer I've got. Swamp. <laughs> not the word I've got. <laughs> <laughs> no. Oh, okay, okay. Um, oh. Correct. In a cup of tea, you would normally find tea, water, milk, and what? Sugar. Incredibly, literally no one caught on. But there was one person I knew I had to be extra careful with. See, Tom GW here, we have a bit of history with YouTube competition. Last year, he pranked me fairly with a fake Twitter page. <laughs> then at Christmas, we had a competition to see who could make the best song. And we scraped by on that one, which makes it 1 1 but I want to win. So after throwing a few bonus words in, especially for him. Name of YouTuber who faced off against myself in the Christmas song battle. Oh, Tom GW. Yes. What's the first line of Bohemian Rhapsody? Is this the real life? Great. Jeff Bezos owns a company that starts with what letter? A. What could you expect to show up at a kid's birthday party to make balloon animals? Liam Bedford. <laughs> <laughs> Correct. That's really quick. I made sure I let Owen know that this was happening and to tell Tommy he had the same questions. And that worked. I also gave Leah the same Tom GW question in case they spoke about it. Tom GW. Correct. Then I thought it'd be nice to keep the fake game show spirits up by letting every YouTuber know that they were winning the fake game show. As it stands, you're at the top of our leaderboard. Woo! How do you feel so, about that? I'm happy with that. Yeah. Happy. I'm, I'm happy with my performance, you know what? I'll, I'll give myself a solid 8 out of 10 for that. Well, technically, you get yourself an 8 out of 8. You are actually first at the moment. So, congratulations. And the ballast for bitches. There we go. It was, it was a, a, a dodgy start. However, because <laughs> <laughs> you smashed the last 5 or 6, and I'm actually, you're either first or second. I'm going to need to check the other scores, but that's pretty bloody good. Out of how many? We've done seven out of the eight already. They're all seven. Oh, so you started asking me what shit I actually knew about at the end. Yeah. Bloody hell, that was quick. That's the quickest we've had so far, I'd say. Rapid. Look at that, he's got the award. He knows. He knows that he's up. <laughs> what, what's that award for? Uh, well, a number of things, you know, just... I think that one was for, um... All round blow. And now that the quiz is packed away, it's time to present you what it was actually all for. 
Enjoy. Soon may the weatherman come to bring us sugar and tea and rum. 